Hey everyone, my name is Jamie Lee. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching this video today. Now today we are revisiting a brand that I've talked about a few times on this channel and that is Halara. In the past when I've featured Halara on this channel, I've mostly looked at their workout dresses and their leggings, but today we are going to be specifically looking at Halara Magic Jeans, which is their line of super stretchy jeans that basically look like denim but fit like leggings, which I'm very intrigued about as somebody who usually struggles a lot finding jeans that fit me, particularly that fit over my butt without gapping at the waist. Now I know over the past couple of years, super rigid denim has really come back into style and I have tried many, many, many different brands trying to find a pair of like these thick, rigid jeans with no stretch that work for me. And I do feel like unfortunately for some body types, they just don't don't work and my body type is one of them. I'm sure you have probably experienced something similar where you put on a pair of jeans and it's either so tight in the crotch and the bum but fits your waist or it's gapping at the waist but fits perfectly on the bum and I'm really hoping that these jeans are going to be an answer to that. Now Halara sent me all of these jeans free of charge and let me pick which ones I wanted to try and they were also nice enough to provide a discount code in case you want to try anything out from this video which will be down in the description box. Now I want to make it super abundantly clear that all opinions stated in this video are still going to be my real and unbiased opinions. I only ever give honest reviews and I will let you know which of these pants I like, which ones I don't. And if you do decide to use that discount code, please do know that I might receive a small commission from your purchase. So if that makes you uncomfortable, please don't ever feel like you need to use it. But if you do use it, thank you very much. Now a couple of quick notes before we dive right into reviewing our first pair of jeans. And we have a lot of different styles and pairs to try on today, different colors. So I'm very excited to get into it. But for each pair that I try, I will include the exact link, what size I got, and which wash of jeans I got down in the description box in the order that I'm trying them in the video. I will also have chapters, so if you watch the video and then you're like, hmm, I really loved that third pair, you can skip back to that to see how it looked. And I will have, once again, all of that information down in the description box. Now in terms of pricing, I would say a lot of stuff at Halara ranges from like the $40 to $60 Canadian range. There is some stuff that's a little cheaper or a little higher. In terms of shipping, I have never had to pay duties for anything being shipped to me from Halara. And I would say it usually takes about one to two weeks to receive anything that I order, which is pretty good. And with that, let's get right into reviewing the jeans. So this is a pair of the high-waisted back pocket leggings in a denim wash basically. So these I do think look like a little pair of skinny jeans that you might get from like American Eagle or something. They are very, very stretchy. And I honestly, when I first held them up was like, they're going to be way too small. But as you can see, they actually fit really great. The waistband I would say is the only indication that you would have that these aren't like real jeans if you were to wear these out and about. So I would recommend just wearing them with a bit of a longer top, something that's going to cover the top of them, if you care about that. If you don't care, I really don't feel like it matters. If this is the type of jeans that works best for your body type, I feel like we need to get over like ostracizing denim legging style jeans. Now these do have real pockets in the back on both sides, so you can store stuff in your pocket if you want to. The front pockets unfortunately are not real, so just keep that in mind, but they do have kind of fake sewn in pockets here to give the illusion of it being denim. Now the length on these, they are slightly too long for me, but because they are tight to the ankle, I don't feel like that necessarily matters. I could easily cuff it once if I needed to, but I think that it also looks okay slightly bunched up. And one thing to keep in mind as we kind of go through the different pairs of jeans, in a lot of the different flare leggings and jeans at Halara, they do have different lengths. So I would just recommend checking out the website, any pairs that you're interested in, and see if there was ever a petite option available, I did get it. But I'm sure that there will be at least a couple of pairs that are going to be a little too long for me because it wasn't available in every pair. 
So overall, I would say I'm definitely a big fan of these ones. I do still like a skinny jean. I feel like they look really good, especially with a more oversized coat option, or if you're wearing like a big cardigan, which I really love a huge chunky cardigan. So I think that these are something that I will definitely reach for. Now, next up, we have a pair of high-waisted stretch denim flares, which I think is very exciting. Now, I've tried some of the flare leggings before from Halara and really like Liked them so I knew I was probably going to like these and I obviously got them in the washed black which I have never owned a pair of black jeans before because I feel like usually they fit completely differently from <laughs> any other wash of jeans and I can never quite get the sizing right versus with these I got them in size medium just like every other pair and I feel like they fit perfectly no gapping at the back because they're stretchy they fit nicely over the bum these ones do have a crossover waist which I got quite a few pairs that had that so I think this will be a matter of do you like how that looks or not. I personally do really like it and obviously I'm trying on everything today with the same top just so that we can see how the pants look with like one look the whole time. And this is just a little bodysuit and I actually think that this looks really good together, obviously quite dark for an outfit for me, but these pants do have real pockets at both the front and the back, and I feel like they do really look like denim to me. They're obviously still quite stretchy and very, very comfortable, like you could easily do any activities in these. Now the flares are just slightly too long for me, but that is to be expected. I'm only five foot one. If you were a little bit taller, I think that these are probably be the perfect length for you. Even for me with a little bit of a heel, I think I could definitely get away with these, which is awesome. And in general, I do feel like these ones are really nice and definitely once again, I could see myself wearing these. Now next up, we have something else that I usually feel like I cannot wear because they just never fit right. And that is denim shorts. Now I feel like these are absolutely adorable. I really, really like them. I know that they're like quite short, so they won't be everybody's thing. And once again, these ones just have that little band, but I feel like I usually wear shorts with a crop top. And for some reason with shorts, I feel like the band does not matter at all. Like I really, really like these. I think they're super, super cute. Obviously these are short enough that I would probably still get chub rub in these. So I wouldn't be able to wear these on like a hike. But I think as just part of like a cute little summer outfit with your little shorts that they look adorable. And similar to the first pair, these ones do not have front pockets, but they do have real back pockets if you wanted to just throw your phone in your pocket or whatever. And I absolutely love them. <laughs> <laughs> I was very nervous about the shorts. I'm not going to lie. I wasn't even going to get any originally because I was like, I don't know how that's going to look on me. I haven't worn denim shorts in so long. I love them. I'm feeling very, very cute in these. And then this is a good example of why I make these videos <laughs> specifically. So these ones are, and I'm just going to take them off. These are the Halara Magic jeans, which are like a crossover waist, high-waisted flare jean. In the shade Lake Blue, these do not fit me at all. There's no possibility, which is interesting because they're the same size as everything else I've tried. It's interesting because they do still feel quite stretchy, but there's no way I could get them up over my butt at all. I do think once they got there, if I could do it, they would probably fit fine. But unfortunately, these ones are gonna have to be a no for me. So for the Halara Magic jeans in general, I would recommend size up if you're between sizes. I am definitely like on the upper end of the medium, mostly just because of my like hip measurement is bigger than what the medium is supposed to fit. But my waist measurement is well within the medium size range. So just keep that in mind. This is one pair where you might need to size up. Now in general, just reviewing this pair still, it does have the flare leg as well, which I think is cute. It has real front and back pockets and it is also a crossover waist. I like the wash on this one. It's like a nice, very dark blue, which I think looks really pretty, but unfortunately they will need to find a home with a smaller bum than me. <laughs> now next up we have a pair of cool touch breathable denim. 
which I think is a very, very cool concept. And these definitely feel like by far the lightest fabric of any of the ones I've tried today. If you are somebody who usually like wears denim and feels like sweaty and uncomfortable, this could actually be a really cool option for you. Now, one obvious and probably glaring downside of them being like a much thinner, breathable, cool material is they're really, really thin. So you're going to be able to see like everything underneath. I am on the like first real day of my period right now. So I am extraordinarily bloated and I feel like you can really, really tell that. Plus where the bodysuit is hitting, I feel like you can kind of see where those lines are. Whereas in any of the other pants, they are much thicker and more like a standard denim. So you wouldn't be able to see that. Now these ones obviously don't have any pockets or fake pockets at the front. And then they do have real pockets at the back, which I appreciate. And these ones are also slightly too long for me. They definitely are dang dangling a little bit at the bottom, but I really, really like the wash on these. I think that it looks really good, like a super great casual denim moment, which I really like. Once again, I'm a little bit bummed out at how thin they are in the front. I wish that maybe there was a little bit more structure in the front, but I do think that they're really cute and would be a great option, like I said, if you're somebody who usually gets too hot in like a typical thick pair of jeans. And lastly for the denim, before I have a little bit of a surprise final thing, is another pair of the black wash denim, this time in a crossover waist, but these are more of the typical legging style, more like the very first pair. These ones are also a little bit unique because instead of front or back pockets, it actually has pockets on the side, which are like quite deep, which is kind of nice. Definitely like a different place where I would usually only see that on like an actual pair of leggings. So I do think that that's a little bit cool and unique. I also do really like the crossover waist. I think that that just really highlights your waist and like draws the eye to the smallest part of you. But as you've seen, they do have ones that are more of like a straight across as well, if you don't like that. Now these ones are pretty much the perfect length for me, which is really nice. I don't feel like I would have to roll these up at all. I feel like they fit pretty perfectly. Now overall, before we get to the super secret final pair of pants, I would say that I'm pretty impressed with the Halara pants that I've tried today. A lot of their denim, feels like pretty thick. It feels pretty good. I would say obviously some felt a little bit thinner than others, in particular the last pair I tried. But if you are somebody who struggles with finding jeans that fit you at traditional brick and mortar stores, I do feel like this could be a good option for you. A lot of these pieces are nice and stretchy so that they'll fit over your bum properly, but they still fit your waist which I just feel like a lot of stores are not making jeans like that right now. Like I said, they're making those more rigid styles, thicker denim, and that just doesn't work for every body type. And then last, but certainly not least, you know I couldn't and let a whole video go by without something pink. We have a pair of the In My Feels ultra high waisted little flares. This is just like a super cozy, soft pair of track pants. Obviously they go comically high on me. Now keep in mind, I'm only five foot one. This is not that uncommon for me. I would likely either roll them over or just leave them a little bit slouchier down here so they're not quite so high, but I absolutely adore them. <laughs> I feel like they're so, so cute. And with that, those are all the different pairs of Halara jeans and a little pair of cute fluffy pants that I have for you today. Like always, if you have any questions, if there's something maybe I miss talking about, definitely let me know down in the comments section and I am so happy to answer any of your questions. Like I said, in general, if you are somebody that struggles with normal jeans or maybe you just want a couple pairs of super, super comfy, casual jeans that you can wear when you're going to the grocery store, you don't wanna wear leggings 24 seven, but you still want the feel of leggings, I do feel like these can be a really good option. Now, obviously there were some that worked better for me, some that didn't work as well, but that's why we make these videos and take a look at everything in depth 
to see which ones are worth the money and which ones are not. And as a reminder, I will have that discount code for you down in the description box. So if you do want to pick up anything from Halara for yourself, including any jeans, any little dresses, maybe some summery shorts, you can use that code to save yourself a little bit of money. And with that, thank you so much for watching this video today. I really appreciate it. I hope that you have a fabulous day and that I will see you next time. Bye.